The streams louder. Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Switcher T Scored, and today I'm bringing you guys a 33 Gun Streak Razorback Nuclear uh, playing 6v6 domination on the map Gauntlet. And uh, Gauntlet is actually back from the first DLC pack in Black Ops 3. And uh, the thing is, you guys, I've had this gameplay saved up for like seven months now. I got this way back at the beginning of Black Ops 3, and I really wish that I had posted this back when I first got it uh, because this map here, Gauntlet, I actually got this nuclear uh, when this map like first came out. I think I was one of the first people in the world uh, to actually have a nuclear on this DLC map gauntlet so I really really should have uploaded this back when I first got it it probably would have actually gotten a lot of views uh, because people love seeing the new DLC maps and they also love seeing nuclears and like hunter pluses and stuff on the brand new maps so I really wish I had uploaded this way back in the day and the only reason I never uploaded this gameplay is just because it's a pretty long nuclear it's like seven minutes or like eight minutes and uh, I just thought it was a pretty slow paced gameplay and I really don't like uploading super long videos because uh, they're just really hard to commentate to be honest but I figured today I would upload this video for you guys so that it doesn't sit on my computer any longer so hopefully you guys enjoy I've only uploaded one other nuclear from Black Ops 3 on my channel and that was actually uh, you know a while back it was like a couple of months ago but uh, this is actually only my second nuclear in the game I only have two in total so hopefully you guys enjoy this one and uh, like I said it's a 33 3 gun streak using the Razorback and I was just playing solo in 6v6 and the cool thing you guys is that my specialist in this game was actually the kinetic armor and I only have uh, two nuclears in total like I said the other one was with I think combat focus I want to say I can't remember totally but uh, this one was with kinetic armor and I always thought my first nuclear in this game would be with uh, one of the specialists that I use a lot like the ripper or the scythe or maybe combat focus because those are the ones I really love and I feel like I play my best with those I honestly have hardly any playtime with kinetic armor and I remember in this game I wasn't even trying to go for a nuclear I have uh, you know UAV lightning strike and hellstorm missile I don't even have like counter UAV or or hater and I thought that made this gameplay way more impressive I don't have EMP or hater or any sort of good kill streaks like that for going for nuclears I literally was just trying to play for fun and just you know have a good time playing black ops 3 and somehow in this game I got my first nuclear and then also I remember back when I got this my connection wasn't even that good in this game so I thought this was insane you guys and then also I got a few kills with my kill streaks as well so not only was it a 33 gun streak but I started out like 41 and 0 or like 42 and 0 and then I think I died like right before the end of the game so I don't remember my final score I think it was like 46 and 2 or like something like that so uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this 33 gun streak Razorback nuclear and that's pretty much all I have to say about the gameplay but uh, in today's video you guys I actually want to do another Q&A video and I think this is the 11th Q&A on my channel so if you guys want to see me do more Q&A videos go to the playlist on my channel that's called Q&A videos and you guys can see me answer a lot of questions over there so uh, also you guys please leave me more questions down below I love making Q&A videos and answering all your guys' questions so you know please leave more questions down below for me to answer and the first question today you guys comes from King Quan the goat he says how is college so if you guys don't know I'm going into my second year of college and there's a lot of ways I could answer this question but I just want to say college is going really well uh, the main thing is it's a lot of work you guys if you guys are going to college uh, I mean it's a lot of work if you want to do well I know some people in college they go and party like every night and they don't really do that well and you know that's not me you guys I don't party at all I, I've never even been to a party before but I I focus a lot on school so uh, when I'm down in college it's only about like two hours from my house so I come home pretty frequently but the thing is it's just a lot of work if you want to get good grades and be successful and stuff you have to put in a lot of time and energy so the thing is you know college is fun I enjoy taking my classes I enjoy learning new things and having fun and living on my own and stuff but the thing is it's a lot of work and that's m the main way I want to answer this question is just it is really hard it's a lot more difficult than high school if you're trying to do well and also right now I'm taking like calculus 3 and like all these crazy classes so it gets pretty difficult but if you want to do well just put in a lot of time and effort and you'll be just fine in college so 
Uh, the next question you guys comes from Aqua Sucks at Gaming. He says, what was your biggest fear as a kid? And I would say probably my biggest fear as a kid was the dark, uh, which sounds really lame, but I just remember back when I was little, I was really scared of the dark. I slept with a nightlight, like, back when I was a kid all the time. I think I slept with my light on, like, my main light in my room, like, all the time. And, uh, I don't know why, you guys, I was always scared of the dark, and I think it was because I watched a lot of, like, scary movies as a kid and stuff, so I was always really afraid of that that but uh, also you guys I've always been really scared of like spiders and snakes and stuff uh, those are some of my biggest fears and then sharks you guys definitely sharks I would say spiders not so much but snakes and sharks uh, those are two things that are like some of my biggest fears in life and then also you guys now that I'm older now I'm 19 years old Probably my biggest fear in life is uh, just losing somebody that I love. I always think about, like, you know, what's going to happen if my grandpa passes away, like, tomorrow? Or what if, you know, when my dad goes on his business trip tomorrow, what if he passes away or something? I'm always scared of that, just, like, losing somebody that I love, whether it's, uh, you know, a grandparent or my sister or one of my parents. Uh, that's always one of my biggest fears, you know, in life. And the next question, you guys, is from Matthew Placencia. He says, have you played Defiance? It's an MMORPG game, uh, first-person shooter, and I have not played Defiance. I really don't play that many video games anymore, you guys. I'm 19 years old. I still play Call of Duty occasionally, but mostly I just make YouTube videos and stuff with all the old gameplays that I have saved up. So mostly I play, like, Black Ops 2, MW3, Black Ops 3, but I don't play, like, other games like that. I know there's a lot of really good games out there, and I honestly wish that I had more time like I did back when I was younger. I used to play so many video games, you guys, like every single Mario game, every single Pokemon game, all the Uncharted games, lots of sports games, just every single video game you can think of, I pretty much played those games, but, you know, nowadays I just don't have the time like I used to to play a lot of video games. I'm an adult now, I'm really busy and stuff, so I play when I can, but I don't have as much time as I used to. And then the next question, you guys, comes from Aqua Sucks at Gaming, and he says, track or cross country? And a lot of you guys probably know this, but back in high school, I did both track and cross country, and I did track all four years. I was a team captain uh, my senior year, and I was varsity for like three and a half years. And then in cross country, I only did it my senior year, and I was a team captain, but I would say, you guys, I love track a lot more. I love doing sprint races and stuff, like doing the 800 and the 1500. Uh, my mile time back in high school was like 440 and then I could also run the 800 which is a half mile in 207 so I love the sprint races just going your all out sprinting against somebody else is so much fun and so I love track a lot better and I feel like I'm a lot better of a speed runner now that I do I knew I do marathons now but I love speed races so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video peace out you guys